Hello everyone and welcome to our guide on how to add more RAM into your Minecraft server. Most of the time when you're playing Minecraft, it's usually a cakewalk. Not to say that the game is easy, but usually there's nothing that's going to ruin your gameplay experience, no matter how hard you try. That being said, sometimes if you're playing on a server with many, many people, this can cause some lagging issues or overall trouble loading in general. Combine this with a large number of mods or plugins and you're definitely going to need to get more RAM on your server. Luckily for you, this guide is covering just that topic today and the many different ways to do it. Upgrading your Nitrato server. First and foremost, let's cover the panel side, shall we? First, scroll down to the left hand side where you see up slash downgrade. Once you're in that new page, you're going to scroll down and see an area where you can adjust how many players you want on your server as well as how much RAM you want on the server. If you want to add more RAM through the server, it will cost a little bit of extra money, so just keep that in mind if you are wanting to upgrade. Although I can assure you upgrading is worth it. Adding RAM to Minecraft Launcher To do this directly through your Minecraft Launcher, which is client side, you want to head to your installations tab and go to the section where you see your installation that you're running. Click on the three dots and hit the edit button. Once this new page pops up, what you want to hit is the more options button and some new settings will appear. Under JVM arguments, you want to adjust this first section where you see the 2G. Go ahead and change the number to whatever you want to have for gigs of RAM. If you want three gigs, then you add simply three instead of two and you can always change it back if you don't like it. Adding RAM to CurseForge Launcher If you're doing this through the CurseForge Launcher, what you want to do is head over to the bottom left hand corner where you see the COG, which is for settings. Underneath the game specific settings, click on Minecraft. From here, you want to scroll down just a little bit to where you see the Java settings, allocated memory, and this big old slider that you can adjust with the little ball. Adjusting this ball is what changes your RAM and automatically saves it. Adding RAM to the FTB Launcher To do this through the FTB Launcher, what you want to do is go ahead and open up the pack in question you want to add more RAM to. In the top right corner, you're going to see the Settings button, click it. Then you'll see, once again, another big old slider with a ball in which you can adjust the RAM. The bigger the number, the more the RAM. Adding RAM to the AT Launcher Whew, this is a lot of launchers, huh? Well, if you want to do it through the AT Launcher, head over to the right hand side where you see the Settings button. From here, you want to go to the top left where you see the Java slash Minecraft tab. Click on that and the second setting option that you can change is the max amount of RAM that you could have. For example, you could change it up to 8000 and that will boost up your RAM. Conclusion As covered in the intro, there are plenty of reasons to add more RAM to your server, but overall, it's just something interesting to know in case you need to adjust it higher or lower. If you happen to like this video, please consider leaving a like, subscribing, and ringing that notification bell, that way we know this is the type of content you like to see. Until next time! Huh. Huh. Oh, <laughs>